Well, we have new information tonight on the new Washoe County Superintendent. Due to a technical problem with the agenda, the board has rescinded its decision to appoint Tracy Davis just hours after appointing her. The board's agenda from this afternoon includes the discussion and possible action on a superintendent search. But according to district officials, in order for the board to appoint Davis, as they did around 5.30 tonight, her name should have been included in that agenda item. If not, it could be construed as a violation of the open meeting law. The district says a corrected item will be on an upcoming agenda. Davis was appointed the interim superintendent after the ousting of Pedro Martinez last year. Davis has served in that position since October. And tonight, the Board of Trustees voted 6-1 to one to retain her for the job rather than search for new candidates. The decision came as a surprise to many since there had been several options on the table, including an expensive nationwide search. Ultimately, they said they didn't want to spend the money and they're happy with what they have. I've seen the work that she's done for the past three years. You know, if you look at our graduation rates and the work that we're doing here in the school district, Tracy Davis has been behind that all along. Along with the strong support from the trustees, Davis had several community leaders speak on her behalf, including current and former district employees. We spoke with Nick Smith, the one dissenting trustee. He says he's not against Davis. He just wanted a more extensive search process that involved getting more input from parents. Our parents are the ones with the kids in the district, and I would have liked to have given them the opportunity to have a voice. Now, district officials weren't able to tell us when the corrected agenda item will be put forward, but of course we will be sure to let you know when they decide on a date.